it's men's health month and one big topic that always comes up is testosterone and so i just want to bring up why you should get testosterone levels checked uh number one it's it's super common for guys to have low testosterone so often i'll just check testosterone some other markers associated with testosterone too and then um and then I usually talk about if the levels are low, which is actually super common in men, uh, I'll talk about treatment options. Some of the symptoms of low testosterone could be most commonly I see like fatigue, low sex drive, erection issues, but also brain fog and then depression as well. Uh, and even, even problems like uh, you don't have as much endurance or strength when you're exercising. And so often if uh, levels come back low, I'll talk about treatment options for patients. And the testosterone treatments can be anything from testosterone shots, that you do like once a week injections, you can do testosterone in cream forms, a cream you apply every day, and then testosterone pellets, which often is kind of kind of like the easiest because you just put the pellets in subcutaneously by me, and then they slowly dissolve over a three month period. So just put it in, don't worry about it. And then after so much time, I'll just repeat the testosterone levels just to see with the testosterone and even estrogen markers, and then any additional things too, because sometimes if you're if you're overweight or if you have diabetes or high cholesterol, that can influence your testosterone levels. And then even stress. Stress is probably the biggest culprit for low testosterone in men. So it is a super common condition in men to have le uh, low levels, but it's also uh, relatively kind of easy to talk about the treatment options of patients cause just because I see it so often. And so that's what I would typically do when it comes to uh, testosterone treatment.